Good morning children. Hope you are safe and fine at home. Today we will do a craft activity. The name of today's topic is a shapes mobile. A shapes mobile is a craft activity which we will do and which will also make you learn the names of different shapes. You can also learn about colors using this activity. So let's begin. Let's read the instructions required to make this shapes mobile and then do it step by step. Are you ready children? Let's start. Listen, read and then do it. First, take a sheet of chart paper. So you can take any chart paper of any color. You can also use different colors for your shapes. So use colorful paper to make your mobile more attractive. So pehle aap colorful chart paper lenge. Draw the following shapes in big size on the chart paper. Now the shapes are shown to you on the next page which we will see. So all these shapes that are there you have to draw on that colorful chart paper. Color the shapes as you like. If you are taking colorful paper then you don't have to color the shapes. If you don't have colorful paper and you've used plain white paper, then you can color all of your shapes with different colors. After you have finished that, you have to cut out the shapes. So cut out all the shapes that you have drawn or colored. Then you have to make a tiny hole at the top of each shape. Can you see? All these shapes are cut out of paper. And everywhere at the top you have a hole cut out. So using a tiny sharp pencil you can slowly and gently poke a hole on the top of the paper. Do it very carefully or you will tear your paper. Pass a string through the hole. So, jab aap hole banayenge, uske baad usi hole se aapko ek string matlab dhaga. Dhaga pass karna hai us hole se. And then after you pass the string, Make a knot and tie the string to the shape. So make a tight knot and then let it hang on that shape. So this is how you make a shapes mobile. This is the first part where you will cut all the shapes that you have drawn and then hang them on a string or a thread. Now let's see which shapes are we going to do today. The first shape is a square. Square is four sided figure and all the sides of the square have to be equal. Then you have a triangle with three sides. Then you have a circle. A rectangle. Kite, which is also the shape of a diamond. Oval shape. Egg shaped. Heart shape. Cloud shape. A star shape. Rainbow. Crescent moon. Crescent moon is the shape which is smaller than half a moon. Mango shape, flower shape, leaf shape and butterfly shape. 
So children, see to it that you all have drawn and cut all the shapes that are shown to you. And then hung them on a string. Now after you have done this part, let's move to the next part. What do you have to do here? Let's read it. Take two sticks and tie them together in the shape of X. So here is one stick. Here is the second stick. And here where they meet, you have to tie them with a string and then allow it to hang. So here, this forms an X shape. Once you have done this, tie the shapes to the arms of the X with their strings. So here, we have 1, 2, 3 and 4. On all these four parts, you can divide your shapes and tie them with the string that you have hung. So here becomes your shapes mobile and all don't have to be the same way. Some strings should be short, some long. So here you can see some strings are so short, some strings are very long. So you can tie it according to your wish. Tie a strong thread to the center of the X. Here you have to tie this thread very strongly and take a thick thread because this thread has to hold this full thing. So if you take a very thin thread, it will break. So take a thick thread or string and hang it on the center of the X shape. Then using that string, hold your mobile up with the strong thread. Now this mobile that you have made, you can hang it anywhere you like in your house. So this was today's activity on Shapes Mobile. Please do this activity at home and hang your Shapes Mobile in a nice place at your home. Now let's do some questions on this lesson. First one, arrange the following words alphabetically. Alphabetically means they should be arranged starting with A and moving up to Z. In question one, you are given the names of different shapes. Square, triangle, circle, rectangle, Kite, oval, egg and heart. Now you have to arrange this in alphabetical order. So aapko dekhna hai ki pehla akshar kaun sa A se shuru hota hai. A se kuch nahi hai. Move on to the next alphabet. B. Kya B se koi word shuru hota hai? Nahi. Next after B comes C. C se we have circle. So first alphabetical order word will be circle. Then comes D. Lekin D se koi bhi word nahi hai. D ke baad aata hai E. E se egg. So next after circle will be egg. F or G. Dono bhi nahi hai yaha pe. H. H se heart aata hai. To heart. I or J se bhi koi bhi word nahi hai. K se aata hai kite. So write down kite. L, M or N se koi bhi word nahi hai. O se aata hai oval. So write down oval. P, Q se vapas koi word nahi hai. R se aata hai rectangle. After R comes S. S se hota hai square. 
and after s comes t for triangle so last word is triangle is tarah humne sabhi words ko alphabetical order mein arrange kiya hai same way we have to do the second one let's start with a a se koi bhi word nahi hai फिर आता है बी बी फॉर बटरफ्लाई सो फर्स्ट वर्ड इज बटरफ्लाई बी के बाद आता है सी पर सी से हमारे पास दो वर्ड्स है क्लाउड और क्रेसेंट मून अब हम क्या करेंगे फर्स्ट लेटर को छोड़कर सेकेंड लेटर को देखेंगे यहां पे सेकेंड लेटर है एल और यहां पे सेकेंड लेटर है आर इन दोनों में से एल पहले आता है मतलब सेकेंड वर्ड विल बी क्लाउड थर्ड विल बी क्रेसेंट मून सी के बाद आता है डी और ई e, पर यहां पर कोई भी वर्ड डी और ई e से नहीं शुरू होता है एफ आता है एफ ओ फ्लार G H I J K इससे कोई भी वर्ड नहीं है मतलब उसके बाद L for leaf L के बाद आता है M M for mango N O P Q doesn't have any word with these letters R से आता है rainbow और R के बाद आता है S for star. So इस तरह हमने वापस alphabetical order में arrange किया है Question number थ्री Do you find the shapes in the things around you? Talk about any two shapes you spot. तो आज आपने इतने अलग अलग shapes के बारे में पढ़ा है और आपने खुद बनवाया भी है क्या आप इन शेप्स को आपके रोज के जिंदगी में देखते हो या तो घर में या बाहर आपको इन बारे में एक लाइन में लिखना है कि आप इन शेप को कहा, कहा देखते हैं तो कौन से भी दो शेप्स को पकड़ लो और आप उसके एग्जाम्पल्स दे दो आप ये खुद कर सकते हो फर्स्ट वाला जैसे मैं लेती हूं सर्कल so we see the shape in the tires of the car car ke tires circle shape ke hote hai wall clock jo hum deewar pe clock lagate hai wo aksar circle shape ka hota hai a lollipop and plates second shape i have taken square we see the square shape in a carrom board ब्रेड स्लाइस विंडो एंड डाइस क्वेश्चन फोर आपको खुद लिखना है विच इज योर फेवरेट शेप तो आपका फेवरेट शेप कौन सा है आप वो लिखेंगे वे डू यू फाइंड इट यह शेप आपको कौन से कौन से चीजों में दिखता है Talk about it and write one or two lines about it. तो आपको दो लाइन लिखना है पहला आपका फेवरेट शेप कौन सा है और वह शेप आपको किन चीजों में दिखता है ये आप घर पे कीजिए And question फाइव Draw the shapes in your word file and write the name of each shape below it. Note that for leaf and flower you can use the shapes of different leaves and flowers for which other words given here can you use a variety of shapes to aapko apke book mein ye alag alag shapes draw karna hai aur uske niche us shape ka naam bhi likhna hai aur leaf aur flower ko aap apne khud ke shapes de sakte ho जैसे आपने उसे देखा हो यू हैव टू डू दिस एज योर होमवर्क दैट इज ऑल फॉर टुडे चिल्ड्रेन थैंक यू